As we get ready for a big weekend of Art Prize, we want to remind you that one of the biggest nights in the art world happens one week from tonight. The Art Prize Awards are next Friday at 7 o'clock. More than $100,000 in prizes will be announced, including the juried prizes and public grand prize. You can only watch it in one place, right here on Wood TV 8. And Sue Shaw out on the plaza with more on those awards. Sue? That's right, Brian. I'm out here on the plaza. What a gorgeous evening. I'm with Craig Sear, the executive director of Art Price. Thank you so much for joining us. Thank you for having me. It does it get any better than this. I mean, it is alive today. I mean, talk about West Michigan weather. It could not be more perfect. It's gorgeous. Everybody's out enjoying it on this Friday. It's it's wonderful to see everybody getting together. Let's talk a little bit about the public grand prize. A lot of people talking about the prize structure this year. Um, how is that going to be decided? Explain that to us. So all of those prizes, individuals find an award to artists, count towards that grand prize. So any prize you find, award it to an artist, whether it's monetary or non-monetary, it all counts. Okay, it all counts. All right, so we also have daily prizes and how many artists have won that money so far? Over 120 artists have won monetary prizes so far, uh, which is more than any art prize before us. Right. Well, you know, when they change up the structure, it's always a little bit different. There are changes and modifications every single year. Mm -hmm. How did you decide to come up with this structure this time around? Completely based on feedback from artists, venues, and visitors. They wanted to see more artists involved on the prize money side of things. So instead of 11 artists, we now have over 120 artists already this year receiving prize money. Um, and we're just trying to uh, inject that money back into the artist's pocket so that they uh, have the opportunity to create more beautiful art for their fans and hopefully next year. It's very interactive this time around. Um, what's your feedback then for that? Uh, from an interactive standpoint, it's been awesome. Uh, we couldn't be more thrilled with the level of activity in the city, um, interacting with various venues and uh, the artists that they see around those areas. So exploration is an all-time high for visitors right now. Also, people uh, have the ability to buy the artwork, you know, that has been put forth this year that's new. Um, what do we know about that so far? Uh, again, a fantastic opportunity for artists to take advantage of this online auction side of things, uh, put their piece up for sale. So instead of a very one-to-one -one interaction during Art Prize, uh, individual can go home and actually purchase their piece from the comfort of their own home behind a computer screen and 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 place their bids it's a very cool experience for the visitor and the artist and a hundred percent of the proceeds actually go to uh, the artist themselves how much money is available to be awarded this weekend uh, this weekend I believe we have thirty six thousand dollars getting awarded to artists Saturday is an awesome day to come downtown uh, to to do that we're supposed to have fantastic weather uh, and I cannot wait to see the city just come alive again. Yeah, it's fun to see. It's fun to see so many people down here. Craig, thank you so much for joining us once again. And it's very exciting. We're in the middle of Art Prize again, the awards one week from today. Brian?